hello everyone welcome back again to my vlog today i said today i'm going to do a vlog today let me adjust my camera properly yeah i'm going to do a vlog today today i oh my god look at me i'm so so fat now last year i was size 12 this year i'm size 16 can you imagine that friends i'm size 16 i don't know how to adjust this camera so i can see me look at my stomach here oh my god look at it hey my smile getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger bigger my bum is okay but it's the stomach <laughs> so today friends um i'm not doing any gisting today i'm just making a a video on weeks today this afternoon i went out this afternoon and uh, i did some shopping i bought some clothes i'm going to show you guys i went out today i said let me go and shop for myself because sometimes you need to spoil yourself you know we live in the uk right it's not all about sending money home 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 sometimes take yourself out spoil yourself with just at least with 200 pounds a day just spoil yourself buy yourself good things you know i have parents i'm still lucky to have my age parents but i do send them something or so at least once in a month right friends i take myself out and i buy myself things things that i love to buy and i try to i try to live well you know i, I try to live well, even though i'm not i'm not having a good job like that but at least i try to live within my means <laughs> yes i try to and um I would say, yeah, I said, remember, I'm a echo start. Uh, I did economics in my first degree in Nigeria. So when I was back in uni then, when I was growing up, in, in, back in my uni days, they taught us a lot, a lot about how to live within your means, how to economize your money. So I've always learned that right from my uni days. And then I realized that that thing has really helped me up to my adult age at the moment. That I have, I know, <laughs> I know how to do so many things. <laughs> I remember a guy was asking me, I was asking me, I told him I do tailoring, I do writing. I, the guy was asking me, how many did you do at the same time? I said, well, I do tailoring to sew my clothes and I do hair to, to I make my hair myself. I make wigs because you can see I don't, I don't keep hair. I just dye my hair. Uh, I make a lot of wigs. I have lots of wigs. And now I'm doing one wig. Now let me show you my friends. I'm doing one wig. Now let me show you. Can see this week i'm making a wig now this one i put it on my youtube channel this one i teach i teach some uh, people how to make wigs by yourself at home so i'm still working on this one i'm still working on this and this and this and this and this so that is done and today i bought myself some nice clothes today honestly i think today i spent 200 pounds today to buy myself some things i bought this dress i think i saw yeah this one i bought this one i think i bought the 80 pound just for this one mm, it's nice it's, i like the design you know i bought it for 80 pound and i also bought it bling bling <laughs> but it's, okay it's two together i also bought this one as well this one was also 80 pounds so i bought it two of them was uh 160 so the lady the person that sold this for me gave me a discount of uh, 10 pound which i which at the end i paid um 150 at the end for this and what else i'm coming my apartment is small but i love it <laughs> so well, you know, I told you my friends about my how how I economize my money, how I try to live within my means, and how I came about to know so many things I do in it for myself. What I'm still working this week, <laughs> I think I also do brain squeeze as well. You can see my stuff there. I work on this. I've not finished it yet. <laughs> Great. <laughs> I also have what I'm doing here as well. Um, this one. This one is another bread which I did, but I've not finished it. This one is going to be a long length, right? Long length braids. I've not finished this yet, so I'm still working on this as well. 
so that's two weeks i'm working on at the moment so no braids take ages to do take ages honestly take ages to do so my friends what i'm trying to say here is this once you have your hands and you, your income is small my income is small right but i try to live within my means honestly i try to i think my course like i said before earlier my course that i did in uni back then has actually, has actually helped me to learn how to economize my money my little income i have so that has been a real help a boost i know that has really helped me in in economizing my money and learning teaching me how to live within my means i'm not yet to be broke you know i'm not broke so that's it and i also do all that thing i was <laughs> i also like to do i also like to sew clothes i have so many clothes which i've sewn in my other one my youtube channel i like to make dresses as well i love dresses because the material is very cheap so i to buy a nice material it costs 10 pounds you just sew it so i'm working on the kaftan which i made i've not finished that one yet i'm gonna finish it today i think i made this kaftan i don't know if you guys see this kaftan properly ah, i made this lace which i'm seeing i finished the lace actually but i'm still working on the satin on the satin on it you can see the dresses i'm still working on the satin <laughs> so my friends that is how i learned how to manage my money <laughs> i just make dresses for myself you know i don't know if you guys can see it properly no long kaftan so what am i trying to do here right you see my friends if your income is low right i will say something that you utilize your hand you have eyes you have hands you have brain you utilize it and you see just do things because we are not born with these skills we learn it and do you know that when you learn these skills, it helps in your life, it helps to make you happy. You don't really need to get, get your happiness from a man or from a woman. You can get your happiness from creating by creating it by yourself. That is the fact of life. Most people don't know this. <laughs> so, my friends, that is my that is my secret life. I just need to make myself happy. And um, what does well say again? So I've showed you what I did today. Just did, I just did a shop pain and some other stuff. And right now I'm trying to work on my weight. I eat too so much food. I'm just trying to work on my weight because my belly is getting big. Do you know that I went out today to try some clothes? Right? Do you know that I realized that my belly is a little bit bigger and it's not making the clothes come out properly on me properly. And also I'm not a tall woman, I'm just an average height. So I realized that I have to start working on my my on my belly and my breast. My breast is getting bigger. I want a small breast. <laughs> you know, guys, when I when I came to this country, I was size. I think I was I was size six when I came to this country years ago. I was size six. Then I was much much younger. I was size six, and now I'm size sixteen. And it's really scary. Honestly, it is. So I try to walk. So I try to work to see if I can bring down my my belly, but don't know. It's not working. You see, I try to work. This my belly. <laughs> but it's not working. But just what I just realized, I realize I have to stop. I have to reduce my eating. Honestly, I have to. So for now, 